Welcome back to another video, y'all. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. It's cold outside today and it's raining. So I won't be leaving the house today. I'm just struggling and stuff. Anyways, today has been a productive day so far. Um, I did work this morning. Then I was able to do my regular cleanup routine, but I did pick different areas of the house. So when I do my normal cleanup, like tidying up during the week, um, there's the kitchen pretty much gets done every day. You know, because we use the kitchen a lot. So, but like there's certain areas in the house where I don't have to clean it every single day because it's not getting used every single day. Like for example, the bathroom in the hallway. Um, Olivia uses our bathroom, so if anything, she goes in there to brush her teeth, but that bathroom is not really used that often. So I won't clean that bathroom up every day, but our bathroom, I will um, freshen it up and wipe it down and all that stuff every day because it gets a lot of usage in there. So today, I did do the hallway. Um, cleaned out the tub and stuff and um, wiped down everything in there cleaning out the trash can um, what else did I do was I able to do oh Olivia's cleaning up her room I was gonna go in there and do like a deep clean but she needs to clean her room I'm trying to get her into a habit of keeping her room clean and we're gonna break another habit too because today she tried to pull a quick one because I was working so I couldn't keep my eye on every single like moment okay so I went in her room and she's got like three bowls in there a couple of cups some um, a noodle cup that she was eating out of and I'm like no we're not doing that you know if you were at school you wouldn't be able to just sit at your desk and eat all day so we're definitely going to um, change that that is definitely a no-go i would prefer she sit at the table when she's eating so i don't know because this week she's been kind of i wouldn't say like rebelling but just not giving a darn basically you know she's not doing her chores and stuff like that so she's on punishment but you know i'm just kind of over fussing about it every single day so she's deep cleaning her own room today okay since she's not able to play the game or anything like that she literally has nothing to do right now she's done all of her school work she's been out of school for about 30 minutes so hey I gotta go back to work so I need her to be productive as well um, the other thing that I did do today is finishing up the goals that I started writing like as far as well first I think I told you guys I had started on my finances so I've got that out of the way I've got a plan for 2021 as far as our finances so now I'm just trying to get my goals and stuff together for my YouTube channel because now I have another YouTube channel that I'm going to be posting con content on so trying to balance out I don't know if I'm going to do like a schedule for that channel I think for the other channel I'm just gonna upload once a week because that's really like a business channel um, and then I'll put all you know everything else over here but yeah so working on that editing a video from what's today the video from the day before yesterday so yesterday's video there is no editing to that it's just un that one's gonna be an unedited video so it's gonna be kind of long um, but it's basically just me hanging out in the kitchen it was quiet so I just figured I would just talk to you guys <laughs> while I was separating my meat and stuff so that's really all that video is so there's not like a whole lot of editing that I'm gonna do to that um, and I think that's it that's other than you know fine refining going through everything that I've already been working on as far as spreadsheets and stuff just making sure that everything looks good so that I don't have to keep because that's another thing that I need to practice too is not keep going back to you know redo stuff over and over again um, because I'm low-key I believe a perfectionist so and I don't even try to be y'all that's a crazy thing but there's little things like I'm a detail-oriented type of person so 
I've got to make sure stuff is right. <laughs> okay? That's just my personality. I got to, if I'm going to do it, I got to make sure it's right. So it's 8.36. Um, I've been off of work for about an hour or so. And so um, dinner has been ready already. Um, so this is what we're having. I already had the greens going. As you can see, they've kind of dwindled down. Olivia, she's been eating them um, since earlier today. And cornbread, pork chops. So just regular baked pork chops. I went ahead and used that pack that um, was leaking. So went ahead and cooked that. And then we've got some potatoes. So there's regular potatoes and then sweet potatoes. So I believe these are the sweet potatoes. And then this is the other regular potato. Olivia doesn't like sweet potatoes. So she's got a regular potato. So she's already eaten. She just didn't get no uh, cornbread. But for her, um, since her dad has gone back to work, it's just me and her most of the time here again. So by me working, I can't keep a good eye on her. Like I can keep a good listen out for her, but when it comes to making sure she does her chores in the beginning part of the day, there are going to be a lot of times where I'm going to be working around those times because I generally choose my hours in the morning. I try to link it up with her being in school and, you know, doing my hours then. Um, there are a lot of times where I do work in the evening. So um, for the times in the morning, I really need her to focus on getting into a habit of doing her chores. I want it to become an everyday thing. I want it to be something that she just naturally does um, versus me having to remind her every day. And then we have the same old conversation and girl, it gets tiring. So what I decided to do, it just popped in my head. I was like, OK, if I have a dry erase board, I can just write down how to clean the kitchen because I'm also going to change what I've got her doing. I've only got her doing the dishwasher and as far as the kitchen goes and that's pretty much it she just loads the dishwasher empties the dishwasher and that's pretty much it unless we add something on to it like if there's some dishes um over here that needs to be put up then i might tell her um make sure you put those up when you empty the dishwasher or something like that but instead of me having to do it every day i think that if she just sees it hopefully she'll just make it a habit okay so now that she's a little bit older I'm adding to her responsibility I'm gonna have her clean the full kitchen the same way I would do it so I basically just made a list of what I generally do when I clean the kitchen and it doesn't have a magnet in the back um, but I do have these removable hooks from a Dollar Tree y'all okay do not buy these if you are going to put them on your wall because when you try to take them off, it will tear your paint. I think I shared that with y'all before. I think I even showed y'all where it ripped the paint off in my bathroom. And then in my room behind my chair, like y'all can't see it when I be sitting at my desk. Y'all can't see it but because it's covered up. But when I try to take the hook off the wall, it took off a piece of the drywall, y'all. So... Do not recommend those. If you're going to get these kind of hooks, go with the common or the, the command. Go with the command brand. Don't tear your walls up trying to get these Dollar Tree joints. Now, I figure it will work okay on this refrigerator because it's not going to pull nothing off. It's just the refrigerator. So, here's what we have going on. I had three left in the pack. And I was like, well, how am I going to get this to stay? So, boom. Just slide it in like that Olivia's standing right behind me I'm glad you're here my dear <laughs> uh, but yeah so when I put it up there I was literally holding this up there because I wanted it to be balanced 
so I was holding this and I just did one at a time basically and so that it won't fall over just put that one upside down and boom and when I'm ready to take these down I, I suppose just like you know any other one like this the command brain you just pull it down I'm saying I suppose like I don't know that's what you do you pull this down and take this off but I'm pretty sure it's not going to damage the refrigerator because smooth surface so this is the list we're going to collect all dishes around the house okay load the dishwasher empty the dishwasher so the L is for lunchtime the B is for before bed so twice a day okay and you have a bigger responsibility now because you're a little bit older so you have more to do so you're gonna have to clean out the sink too because I've noticed that you don't clean out the sink but it's okay we're starting fresh okay we're wiping the slate clean because we're gonna go by this list right yes don't Why do that because I'm not to help you out to give you a visual to give you a visual of what to do okay so that you don't have to wait on me to, to um tell you to do it so i'm helping you out we're being proactive stop playing see okay but anyway so here put the top back on this and stop playing so yeah y'all because she's distracted move out the way i'll talk to you i'll talk to you about it personally off camera okay so yeah so i have the um wipe off the countertops because that's what i normally would do i wipe off the countertops and i've got the color spray so the green spray that i'm using um is an antibacterial so i prefer her to go ahead and use the antibacterial so i'm just referencing the color of the spray so that she knows which bottle to grab because i've got two bottles i got one that is just a multi-purpose it has the pink um spraying it i love the way it smells and it's this the clorox so that's that and then <clears throat> the comet so this is the antibacterial so i'd rather her use these on the countertops and on the stove and put away dishes on the countertop make sure they're dry because sometimes she has a habit of not making sure they're dry before she puts the dishes up wiping down the dining room table sweeping the floors in here and in the dining room and then starting the dishwasher so starting the dishwasher is last so this is basically the order so by the time you get to this point all of this should be done and the only thing left is to just hit start on the dishwasher the only thing i don't have on here is actually mopping the floor so no. we might add that in later because i used a little swiffer mop thing so it's not that hard but um, we'll have to see how this goes first before we start adding on. So, so yeah. So we're gonna try that out and see how that goes. And um, here, since you're standing here, go ahead and put those up, please. I've already loaded the dishwasher for you. So go ahead and put that up. You just have to end up. You'll just have to start it before uh, you go to bed today, because I needed to use the sink. So it's just ran away. <laughs> Can I make some cake? Make some cake? Yes. What, what kind of cake? I'll come back. All right, so yeah, we're going to try that out and see how that goes. Um, you know, we'll, we'll see, we'll see. Hi. Oh, party rainbow cake? Yes. Let me see. Let's see, vegetable oil, three eggs. Yep, we sure can. <laughs> 